Hey y'all, it's Britt. So I have a Happy Mail package to share with you. And I was so excited to receive this. Look how cute this is. I did go through everything already and I apologize, but I was kind of like excited and I was having a bad day. So I opened it already. And this is from Gail and we decided to swap embellishments and stuff on Instagram and this is what she sent me and her packaging is so cute so this was on the top and it said opening the gifts and then look how cute this tag is it says North Pole Express Delivery Service recipient Brittany naughty or nice she said I was nice delivered via sleigh <laughs> open on December 25th and Gail Shepard. Isn't that cute? And then she wrote um, a little note for me on the back. I just think that's so cute and I wanted to save the sticker and everything. So um, I'm just going to take everything out so I can show you what a cute package she sent me. And in the package she has so is this gold t tinsel which I will sh keep and reuse and some candy and a candy cane and then a peppermint or candy cane Tootsie Pop which is super cool I've never seen this before so super sweet and then um, she sent me some extra goodies look how cute this little ornament is it's a little reindeer and look how cute she is and she has a little hat and look at her sweater and her skirt oh it's from Target I didn't get to go buy any ornaments from Target this year look how cute oh I love this it's so cute you guys that's gonna go on my shabby tree um, and then she made this for me look how cute I love how she makes her rosettes and she adds glitter to them it says Merry Christmas and this is a cute little chapstick holder that I am totally going to re-gift. I'm going to keep the chapstick for myself and then hopefully this would be cute to give to my little sister in, one of, in her Christmas present next year. Because she loves chapstick. If I could get it open. Oh no. Come on seam binding. See because I didn't open it yet. So like open open it yet. Ah there we go. Haha. -ha. But look how cute. She must have a die for this. There must be. Because it looks like it was cut by die. Because it has the little um, holder ends. So you're going to have to let me know what, um, what die this is. But look how cute. And she sent me some sweet and shimmer lip balm. Vanilla bean. Super cute. Where is this from? Groovy. Hmm. Well, it's gluten free. <laughs> but look how cute. So I'm assuming it has some like glitter in it. So super cute. So that chapstick's for me. And then this little holder will be so cute to put some chapstick in and give to my little sister. Isn't that cute? I love that. And then look at this. This she must have a either a cut file or something for, but look how cute. It's a little, like, box almost. See, like, it's like a little box, and it has a hole, and these little tubes she has fits in them, fits in here perfectly. Look how cute this is. See her little, this is so cute. So I'm totally going to, like, use the trim, obviously, and then it would be really cute to put, like, candy, or even you can fit, like, think two chapsticks in here um, or it'd be fun to you know put something in here and gift it to someone like that isn't that cute that'll be so cute to give to someone I'd probably wrap some ribbon around this so this wouldn't try to make this not like fall out but look how cute that is it's such a cute idea you could put candy in there but she gifted me some pom-pom trim which I have like none <laughs> and this is like the mini kind so super cute I can make some of those little like DIY Maggie home frames for Christmas and stuff next year 
So super, or this year, sorry, <laughs> it is the new year. But look how cute her rosettes are. But this is such a cute idea. Um, and then there was this little bag um, with this cute clip and these really pretty glittery cardinal stickers. And then look at this cute primitive clip. Love it. And I love the bag. Totally going to reuse it. And she gifted me some big fluffy pom-poms. These will be fun to make like little charms with or um, paper clips or really anything with that. And then she gifted this really pretty, um, it's from a piece of trim, but it's like this ribbon rosette. Super pretty. So let's stick those in there. I love these bags. I love like the gold pattern, the gold and white bags. It's so pretty. So she sent me that and then she sent this little package and this was just an extra gift that was in there but I just used it because this accidentally fell off. And I actually used to have these bags um, but look how cute the little bow fell off the top but um, she sent me some goodies in here. So da -da -da -da. my favorite thing in here is this um, what's it called? The tinsel, um, eyelash trim. And I don't know where, I have to check maybe Joann's because, um, unless you order it online, these are hard to find. And I love using this for everything. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to go on the hunt for some of this. So super cute. Thank you so much. And then here's some of her rosettes. Look how cute. Like, she makes them super gathered. It looks like she used a die because it has, like, the score marks. So she definitely used a die. But look, she puts, like, the chunky glass glitter. Sorry, it's, like, not focusing. The chunky glass glitter on the edge. And look how pretty. Look how cute. So there's that one. And then there's this cute one with my favorite paper. I think this is, yeah. And then the little Santa Hot Cocoa. Love it. Um, and then she gifted me some Holly Berry washi tape. Super cute. I don't have much Christmas washi tape. And then she cut out and glittered these deer heads. Which I don't have this dye. I need to get one of these. Because um, like everybody has them. So she cut it out in like a thin chipboard. And the patterned paper. So they're nice and sturdy. And then she glittered them. So she did that herself. Look how pretty. So thank you so much for taking the time to do that. And I like that they're in like primitive vintage style. Um, and the little bow. And then this I just, like I said, I use just to keep the bow on there. She gifted them in the next thing, which is this cute paper purse. Look how cute. She made this paper purse for me. I love this paper she used and she did one of the little um, stitched um, shaker uh, circle embellishments. Super cute and she has it velcroed. I love this. Look how cute. And she stuffed this with goodies. So um, she has some of these gold flowers that I can layer and this like branch of leaves that she cut out super pretty um she gifted some of these wooden reindeers there's one of the big um reindeers and these little ones look how cute um she made these cute cute little gingerbread man look how cute i love this super cute um then um she made me two of these which i have this in my cart um, on Ali. So when I have extra spare money, I, I just bought a couple things. Um, cause it can get, ex I know Alex Express is cheap, but it does get expensive. Um, when you add up all the different orders, cause you have to pay shipping from different shops, uh, most of the time. But look how cute. I love this one. So this one's green and look how cute she packaged it. This is a green hat Santa, and then she also made me a red hat. Wait a minute. Uh, I think these fell off of packaging, like they were on here. 
I think, or on one of them, or I think that's where they, they, they fell off of the packaging. She has these little banner pieces. But, and then here's the red one she made, the red, you know, the regular Santa. Uh, then she gifted me some American Craft ribbon. I love it, very vintage. Um, she gifted me some trims. Look how pretty. Look at this swan washi. Isn't that pretty? So there's like this like felt tree, Christmas tree trim, which is super cool. I've never seen that before. And then there's some red, green, and gold twine, which is awesome. Very vintage. Love it. Um, then she made these cute little, like, file, you know, like, file folders. But they're not, like, they're little embellishments. So this one says, Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas. This, And then she put the little, she made these itty-bitty rosettes. And look at the cute penguin. And then this one has a snowflake. Isn't that adorable? So I could do some journaling on here. Um, you know, make it a little tuck spot and a mini. You could do a whole bunch of stuff with these. So love those. Um, then she sent some chipboard pieces that she tied together. So there's some stockings and some Christmas trees. Love that. Great base to make some things. And then she sent me some clear uh, acrylic buttons and red buttons and some of the Tim Holtz clear charms which I love using and then in here she also sent some little goodies which hold on okay so she sent some of these cute little cupcake wrappers which I don't have she sent this little pine cone mini pine cone bunch that would look so cute on something she sent some silver jingle bells she sent several of these large fat gold paper clips um i used one of them to hold the that one bag together and then she sent some flares which i don't know if she made these or what but they're like vintage style like very vintage so there's like the the Acorns. This one says Noel with like a tree in the background. Sorry about the glare. Um, this one has a pine cone. Um, little vintage girl carrying a holly bush. Now it won't focus. Here we go. And then like a vintage Christmas lady with her hat and some print and stuff. She has some holly on her hat. There we go. Super cute. I love these. Don't have many flares in my collection, so and I know they're fun to make and use. So thank you very much for sharing with me. And I absolutely love this little purse. It's so cute. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to y'all soon. Thanks again, Gail. Talk to y'all. Bye.